Hey everyone, welcome back to Film Zone. In today's video, we'll be discussing the top five rappers of all time. So make sure you subscribe to the channel and also leave a like on the video. For this list, we're focusing on rappers that have consistently affected pop culture, both with their music and polarizing lifestyles. On my cypher, on my freestyle, and as you see that I go against the grain, you know what I'm saying? They have no choice but to respect. XXX Temptation. This Florida MC gained plenty of media attention early in his career, though not always because of his music in 2016. He was first arrested for robbery and assault with a deadly weapon and then again for assaulting his pregnant girlfriend. Meanwhile, the jailed rapper's hit Look At Me was blowing up on YouTube with the track currently sitting at over 65 million views. As a result of XXX Temptation's reputation grew behind bars drawing more attention through a small tip with Drake, who was accused of stealing X's flow with the track KMT. In June 2017, XXX was knocked out cold during a live performance in San Diego. Less than two weeks later, he assaulted an audience member during a Denver show. Not exactly a smooth start to a career, but those YouTube views don't lie. Young Thug the new school of rappers coming out of Atlanta stray heavily from the genre stereotypes and there is no better example of this than Young Thug. With his flamboyant style and lyrical flow, many have questioned if he's being himself or capitalizing on popular trends. In early 2017, director Ryan Stake documented this bizarre experience on Young Thug's as Wyclef Jean video as the artist himself never showed up. His bizarre melodies and use of autotune both inspires and infuriates people, as does his fondness of the terms lover and hobbies. This combined with his fondness for female-influenced fashion statements has simultaneously won him fans while exposing homophobia within the rap. Two Live Crew in contrast to Young Thug, this Florida group is anything but cryptic. Two Live Crew originated during the golden age of hip-hop and their 1986 debut was so raunchy that a clerk was actually put on trial for selling the album to a minor. After similar issues arose with their second album, Two Live Crew became arguably the most controversial rap group of the time. By 1990, their third album, As Nasty As They Want To Be, was illegally deemed obscene by a United States judge, a decision that was ultimately overruled two years later. This is the 90s and we're coming on strong, saying things and doing things that you're saying is wrong. Despite moral objections, 2 Life Crew brought further attention to rap music along with the concept of free speech. America, we have the right to say what we want to say. We have the right to do what we want to do. Boy, Tway named Troy used to live in Detroit. Nicki Minaj. By perpetually embracing drama and meeting it head-on, Nicki Minaj has become a polarizing but ever-present figure within pop culture. With an aggressive flow, colorful style, and a larger-than-life personality, Nicki is less than subtle with her approach. She capitalizes on popular trends, and she's unapologetic about doing so. Either you love Nicki Minaj or hate her, which means she's always a topic of conversation. At the end of the day, Nicki Minaj will do what's best for Nicki Minaj haters gon' hate. So far, that approach seems to be working out for her. Words to the wise, though, don't get on her bad side. Old Dirty Bastard as a founding member of the Wu-Tang Clan, this MCS legacy has been firmly established. Back in the day, however, the media wasn't sure what to do with this unconventional moniker or his larger-than-life personality. Yeah, baby, I like ODB's unpredictable interviews often baffled fans and critics alike, making him a notable pop culture figure. Dirty is just the negative side of me. You know what I'm saying? The pressure that, that built up inside of me, and then when somebody get on my nerves, it got to come on out. Behind the scenes, the rapper accumulated a troubling rap sheet throughout the 90s, which created negative headlines while simultaneously adding to his mystique. Old Dirty Bastard's decision-making led many to question his mental health as his drug use unfortunately led to his demise at age 35. That's all the time we have for today's video, guys. Thank you for watching, and we'll see y'all next time.